Hello, welcome to my channel. Today we're looking at, I don't know how to pronounce it, Landre Michael Brown. Uh, he's been missing since November 18, 2019 from Salt Lake City, Utah, according to this. Uh, according to this, it looks like there's somebody with the exact same name, same age, looks like the same person, missing from Columbia, Missouri since 3-10-2019. So either way, I don't know if it's the same person or not. You know, some people travel, so it could be. Um, so we have somebody that's missing. So I went to do a John Doe search. I found this one in Birmingham, Alabama, May, thir May 30th, 2019, um, about 5 foot 10. It says white Caucasian, but sometimes they change it, so I'm not going to leave it out. Uh, Partial skeletal mummified human remains discovered on the floor in an upstairs bedroom of an abandoned house. The house had been abandoned for several years and had recently been purchased. The remains were discovered by workers. So I don't think that could possibly be him, but I don't know. I'm leaving that in there. Mummified remains. No tattoos, it says. So they couldn't have been there that long if they could tell if they had tattoos or not, right? There had to have been somebody that was recent, and I believe he has tattoos. And that would mean that they could tell for sure that it was a uh, Caucasian male, right? And so I don't know. I don't see any tattoos of this. All right, so we'll go to the next one. And we have this man, and he's found in Miami, Florida, October 30th, 2019. African-American male, estimated year of death, 2016 to 2019. He was found deceased in a, the elevator of an abandoned building mummified remains and it talks about the clothing and what he was wearing and like I don't know if any of these could be him but maybe he's fine somewhere and okay you know hopefully and then we have a couple more this man was found in Alexandria Virginia uh, September 29th 2020 estimated PMI two years estimated year of death 2017 to 2019 Skeletonized remains found um, in a wooded area near an interstate. Remains of an abandoned homeless camp were found nearby. Been deceased for at least a year, but more than likely two to three years. And so there's that. There's the clothing that the person was wearing. And then the next one is Knoxville, Tennessee, but this is white Caucasian, found November 18th. 2022, but I, sometimes I just leave them in there anyway. Uh, estimated year of death 2018 to 2021. Tree clearing service found skeletal remains in the area. The area is cleared about every four years. Uh, they believe that the death likely occurred about 18 months prior to discovery. So, and you can read that if you like. So, they don't know what happened to their loved one. And I'm not sure if this is the same person, but either way, please pray for their loved ones and their family. If you have any information, please contact the family or the authorities to let them know. You, you might not feel like it's relevant, but it might help them create some sort of a timeline. Maybe you knew where he was, who he was with, anything that you have, no matter, how, you know, let the authorities or the family, let the, I would contact the authorities and let them decide what's important and what's not to help them solve the case. And uh, like I said, please pray for his family and his loved ones. Feel free to leave comments and have a blessed day. Bye-bye.